Hello and welcome to the Calculator Guy video on using the solve function to find when an input and output are the same. You may have come across these type of questions before. Here we have a number machine and the process of going from input to output is to multiply by 5 and then subtract 14. And the question is we need to find the input value for the number machine that gives the same as the output value. Before we start with the calculator, what I'm going to do is to use a letter, so I'm going to use X because that's what the calculator uses, uh, to represent the unknown. We don't know what the input is, we don't know what the output is, so we're going to use X to represent that, and then that will enable us to use the calculator solve function to solve this particular problem. Press X to display X, and then what you need to do is to type out the processes of the number machine on your calculator. So in this case it's multiply by 5 and then subtract 14. We're going to insert an equals here because we, we want to go to our output. So press alpha and calc to get an equal sign on your calculation line. And then we want the same output as we had input which was the letter X. So we're just going to press the letter X again. In order to solve the equation, then we need to press shift and calc, which does the solve function. There will be a number displayed up here. That is a previous answer, or it could be zero if you've not used it before. If you press equals, then we get the answer to this particular equation. In this case, it's 3.5. So when the input is 3.5, the output is 3.5. And then we can use the calculator to check that this is correct. So if we type out 3.5 times by five, minus 14, we're going to get an output of 7 over 2, which is 3.5. Okay, so there we have how we can use the solve function to resolve a number machine where we want the input and the output to be the same. That's it for this video though. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time on the Calculator Guide.